perfect. Well, can I try it on? Oh, can't take it off. Why not? Because it's too dangerous. I'll met you on that. You can be safe as well. Safe? From what? They tried to get to me this morning, so... They're in disguise. They can't follow me. See, they're out there now. They're waiting for the chance. We've got to watch it every second. What are you talking about? See, I know what they're up to. That's why they're trying to get to me. Nobody's trying to get you. You've got to stop thinking like this. So, I'm just trying to warn you. I'm worried about what could happen. See, the are in. Who, Joe? The aliens. But there are no aliens. Not really. I mean, you do know that, don't you? You know it really. I'm not sure. But it's that. just films. It's all made up. Nobody's been taken off. I am so scared, Sarah. None of it. It doesn't make. It doesn't make any sense. What am I gonna do? Have you tried talking to your mum about how you feel? No, no, no. She, 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 she can't know. She can't know. I can't tell anyone. You, you, you won't tell anyone, will you? Tell who, John? See, they will put me back in hospital, and they'll, they'll, they'll put me back on those pills, and then they'll take over my brain again. To get some help. No, I'll be all right. I just got the turf left. Come on. <laughs> Lorraine, did you hear me, love? Oh, sorry, I was miles away. Oh, is everything all right? Yeah. How are you? You mustn't grumble. How's young Joe these days? Fine. Why do you ask? Oh, I was just wondering. Actually, I saw him in the square this morning, and to be honest, he was a bit off out. Oh, he's, he's just been a bit moody lately. He's bored, fed up with being in the flat. He just needs a proper job. Well, he's still working here, isn't he? Yeah, when he remembers to turn up. I don't think he appreciates the chance Grant's giving him. Is Grant doing it for you or him? He's a good man, Pat. He's been a real friend to both of us. I've known Grant Mitchell a lot longer than you have, love. I don't want to see you get out. I know what I'm doing, Pat. That's why I've got my own place, to have things on my terms. I know where I stand, and so does he. Well, if you can keep Grant Mitchell in line, you'll be the first woman to manage it. Hello, Sarah. Uh, can I talk to you, please? Yeah, of course. What is it? Well, it, it's sort of, um... <laughs> Look, why don't we go through, eh? Okay. <laughs> Joe. I really appreciate the time you're spending with him. Oh, you've really gotten back to his old self. Oh, we're just friends, that's all. So you really think he's back to normal then? Uh, why do you say that? Well, it, it's just that he's been saying some funny things. Like what? He keeps talking about aliens taking people over. <laughs> it's just the TV, the X-Files and all of that. He talks like he believes it. Well, I think it's just his hobby, that's all. I don't think it could be anything else. He'd say if he wasn't feeling well. He knows the signs this time, and I know what to look out for, too. Right. OK, well, I shouldn't have bothered you. No, listen, you should say if you worry, but don't be. I'm keeping an eye on him. Right, well, don't tell him I said anything. No, no, of course not. Listen, thank you. OK, bye. Joe! Joe, will you turn it down? Joe? Joe, why won't you answer me? Stop this, please!